Trustworthy Systems as a group has three principal themes. Uh, one of them is operating systems, one of them is formal methods, and one of them is programming languages. And all of those three things are put together to produce what Trustworthy System does. We build the lowest levels of software, which is really key to ensuring security and reliability of a computer system. If the operating system is not reliable, then the rest of the computer system cannot be. We are experts in understanding how the hardware operates and how you have to drive it, but we combine that with what's called formal methods, which are mathematical proof techniques that we, that we apply to our software. One example of a success story that's come out is um, the SEL4 operating system kernel. An operating system kernel is a small operating system that sits underneath all the other um, programs on a device, say, um, for example, on your laptop or whatever. And those things are very, very hard to program because they have to be super efficient. So the principal contribution that Trustworthy Systems has made there is to take formal methods which helps you to make things right and put it together with operating systems, which is completely on the other end of the scale, which encourages you to cut corners and do things in a funny way and actually put them together. And that has had an enormous impact. The idea is um, SEL4 will be the Linux of the embedded world. And that's what we're aiming for. And of course, the effect will be that we really see a complete different attitude towards reliability of computer systems. Instead of expecting them to fall over, we will expect them to be actually trustworthy and dependable. Um, and I see that happening over the next five or ten years. But it's an exciting area to be in, actually. I think what's going to happen is that the success of trustworthy systems will spread exponentially and will convince people that they really should be doing things using our stuff or using our methods and it will actually, maybe even within a decade, radically change the way people think about making uh, important software.